Hello, targeted individuals. Have y'all ever noticed something? <clears throat> I know that there's no money in truth. Basically, you know, if you on, if you have like YouTube, um, a blog, or TikTok or Twitter or whatever, being targeted, they have us all shadow banned. So, um, like basically, if people say that if you have a niche, um, you can monetize, you know, whatever social media platform or blog or whatever, but it seems like if a person does a niche about, um, old fashioned living or soap making, um, cleaning boats or um, cooking food or, you know, taking care of babies, natural living or something, those can get monetized and people can make a good living off of that. But I noticed that when they have targeted individuals who are bloggers and stuff like that, um, unless their blog has been on on the internet for like 20 years, their blogs kind of don't even get, don't even get that much traffic or they don't, the blogs don't even get that many views, you know? So, um, yeah, it seems like targeted, talks about targeted individuals, gang stalking, um, and, um, like, the direct energy weapons or remote neural monitoring, Zersatung and all that. Did I pronounce that right? Zersatung or Zersetung? I don't know how to pronounce it, but excuse me for not knowing how to pronounce that. So, um, so I, I guess our category is the only niche that kind of, I guess, can't be monetized. So, um, I've seen plenty of people be monetized for talking about narcissistic abuse. And that's not considered a threat. But oh, it ties in with targeted individuals and gang stalking. And when you talk about targeted individuals and gang stalking, that gets shadow banned. And a lot of times you get falsely striked um, for exposing your gang stalking. You can't even make any money or a living from that either.